this. We are going to start with our De La Riva. Okay, so from the position right here, what I want to do is I have my controller here, one or two, and then what I want, double sleeve control, I'm gonna kick one like that, all right? With the Lahiba hook, I wanna step on the mat one, move my hips, and use this leg as a pendulum for me to sit up. So I'm gonna go one and sit up right here, okay? So, do that. From this position, so I have my De La Riva control right here, and then I go one, kick, keep that foot above his knee. All right, keep out, sit up, and finish here with a single leg. Again, this angle right there. So, De La Riva. Leave control, kick the leg, keep it, keep out, pendulum to sit up. Finish here with the arm around the leg. So right now there's no grip right here, there's no grip, nothing. All right, so just the arm right there. That's the warm up for today. So let's go. All right, so now let's see the sweep. The sweep will be right here. Okay, so now the arm that is around the leg, now I, I care where this, this hand will go. Okay, so everything will be the same. Start with the De La Riva, kick to one. So now I don't need some guns. If I try to get this slip right here, what he's gonna do, he, he's always gonna try to break this grip. Even if I have two on one, so he's going to pass it up and break this grip. And that makes it very hard for me to get anything. So if that happens, I'm gonna go one, boom, and two. And that's my grip. And then could be on this side, could be here on this side, could even be here on his belt. All right, but I want, I want a grip right here. And that's my position. If I have the grip right here, this is a little stronger than this, okay? So I get the grip right here, and of course, what he's gonna try to do is, he is going to drive his knee right here on my stomach, on my chest. He's, trying, he's gonna try to control my sleeve, and sometimes he's gonna try to cut across. So I'm waiting for him. So when he gets the position here, so I'm gonna, even then if he gets a grip right here, all right, I'm gonna try to go and control the arm too. All right, so he's gonna drive that knee forward, he's gonna step forward, and then that's my position right here. All right, I still have the grip. The grip is important. All right, so his knees putting pressure on my stomach, on my chest. All right, so I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use the, Top leg right here. So I'm gonna go one and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, it's not, I cannot hit the person, but I'm gonna pull the person right there. When, once his weight is off me, look, it's easier for me to go and go to my knees. Okay? So again. Go one, go here two. I could not get this lead. He's going to pass it up, break his grip, and then I go immediately go right there one and two. So he's going to try to drive to pass one and two here. All right, so look at that. I'm not going to leave that open, it give space for him to pass. See, so bottom leg is important. All right, so this leg right here, the bottom leg, I, I'm, I'm going to try to hook his leg. It's not that I'm going to have my leg free right here and let him back. This is bad. All right, so his foot is always between my legs. All right, so I'm going to go bump him forward and go to my knees right here. A lot of things can happen from this position. Sometimes he's not going to fall. He's going to stand up right here. I'm going to stand up. 
and I'm going to do the takedown. All right? If he stays on the ground, I'm just going to control that top position. No problem. But usually what happens is the person right there, he's going to stand up, but you have that single leg. So that's why that grip is, is, is going to be stronger than just the single leg. Sometimes with the single leg only, you get into that position and the person is able to sprawl and break. But with the grip on the lapel, even if the person sprawls, can still keep that grip right there. Okay, so one more time. So the la riva, push, sit, he's breaking that, go, control that. He's gonna to start to pass. I'm gonna go right here, look at that. Top leg, but go to my knees. If he falls, boom, I control. If he stand up, I'm gonna stand up with the leg, and I have that. I'm gonna take him down. All right, so let's go, let's try that. All right. So now let's see, next one, next one right here. Look. So now, I got my position again. Boom, one. Get up and got the, the, got the grip. You know, again, what happened here, he's gonna break the grip really easy. So my goal is to go right here and catch this, his lead. So when, once I catch this is lip right here, so what I want is, I have a four fingers grip, I get my thumb in for a second, and I push. When, once I push this one, look at my grip. I need that pistol grip right here. This is what, what I want. It's not, a, if I get a grip right here, it's easy for him to again break, all right? So the, the grip right here is one, push, and I get my pistol grip. This is a better grip. Once I get this position, this hand come up right here by his, by his knee. I'm gonna do that spin underneath him. So look, this leg goes between his legs and then I'm gonna bring my hand. So he cannot pull that hand on the mat, look. And then I get on top. One, on top right here, okay? right here. I'm going to start with my Dela Hipa. I go right there. Step in the mat. One. Get right here. He's going to break. Boom. I go. Get his grip. Right here. And then look. I go one. Look where I'm going. I want to go between his legs. I'm going to go. I'm going to keep spinning. Here we go. All right. One more time. One is gonna break that one. I get this one right here. Come in, get my grip. And this one is important. Come up, and then I'm gonna start to go between his legs. Go, 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 go. Till I'm keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Till he falls. And then I get on top. If I pass the guard better, if I don't pass, I'm gonna just establish that top position. All right, so let's go. All right, one more time, pay attention. Ricky wants to see one more time, the same sweep. So here. Oh, position is the same. Double is lift control. Kick the leg, go, sit up. And then I'm gonna try to get this one. I don't get this one here. Immediately what I want, I want, I want to get this, this is lift. So once to get, a good control of this lip is, just, is not just go and get this. This is easy for him to break. All right, so what I want to do is I get my thumb inside, and I know this is illegal, but it's just for a second. So I go one and get my pistol grip. So this is better grip. All right, so now I want to go with the free hand, palm up right here by his knee. All right, so once I get these two grips right here, it's time to 
put my back on the mat. So look, my back goes on the mat. I'm going to throw in my head between his legs. More than I turn, easier that will be the sweep. Handle again, get on top. Okay? So, stop. Break dance, spin. You do here. So, I get the position. This is the arm that I trap. So, I get right here and then I just go right there. Oh. Okay? So, now. So what we did today was one, get the, the lapel, this side, this side, get the belt, anything, any fabric right here. That's okay. All right. So we did here with this hand right there with the near arm. So now it's time to do something right here with this arm. All right. So if I try to do the same thing right here, but I'm holding this arm, he's gonna post that hand on the mat. So by the time that I get here, look, he's gonna post and then at one point I cannot spin anymore. So that's why I'm only gonna do that if I control this arm. If I'm controlling this arm right now, so what I want to do is I one, and then this grip is the four fingers grip. And then I get here too. My hand go as high as it can. Come in right by his ear. So I get one and two. All right, so what I need to do is find a way to block the leg. All right, so this foot can be here low or high, but look, I'm, I'm gonna pull him on top. Just gonna make him do that judo roll. Get on top right here, establish my side control position. Of course, if he steps over this leg right here, it's gonna be tough. All right, so do not miss that. So I wanna block and get on top. So you have three options. Option one, you get the fabric. Option two, you get the near arm. Option three, you get the far. Far on. So let's go. That's the last one for today, guys.